गुड इवनिंग वेलकम टू डॉट प्रोग्रामिंग डॉट कॉम दिस इज माई ब्लॉग थ्रू दिस यू कैन लर्न मोर अबाउट प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेजेस सो टूडे आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट हाउ टू चेक अवेलेबिलिटी ऑफ यूजर नेम इन डाटा बेस टेबल सो आई हैव ए डाटा बेस टेबल विद सम फील्ड्स लाइक आई डी यूजर नेम पासवर्ड एंड ई now write on design enter username and add a text box control also add a button control now change the text of the button a check user availability when we click on the button control check the user is available in the database or not so create a sql connection class con equals to new sql connection on dot connection string configuration manager by using configuration manager we can um, access web dot config file dot connection string is the element in the web dot config file so open the connection establish the communication between the front end to back end by using sql command class we can make the query to the database table so command text is select strict from table name and my table name is register where user name we are user name equals to an address of you name and oops password is not required to check the availability of the user name and email equals to at the rate of em if you want to check both username and the email so add parameter to the query so at the rate u name is similar with the value in the query so text box 1 dot text So now remove email. After that, I will teach you how to check both username and email. So first of all, I want to check username availability in the database table. So SQL data reader, sorry, SQL data reader R D equals to C M D dot execute reader. Execute reader is a method to execute the SQL query. So rd dot has row. Has row means check the availability of the row, or you can say record by the reader. So take a single label control after the text box. Label one dot visible equals to two. 
label one dot text user is already available username already available label one dot all color equals to system dot drawing dot color dot right save this add SQL data source for making the connection string database.mdf connection string is there now copy this remove the line of con uh, configuration manager dot connection string yeah that is now paste it here semicolon use the symbol of at the red that is verbatim literal or run the application Jacob username already available when update Jacob with Jacob one, its same error message is generated. So now use else statement. Change the color is green username already available change username does not available save this and run it again jacob username already available jacob1 yeah username does not available bill username already available now if you want to check both username and email then only simple use the or query email equals to at the rate of em also add parameter to in the query and remove the label from just after this you can add a two box box for email and username create a parameter for email textbox 2 dot text I'm going to use the while command rd.read oops now use the previous method G 
change only the statement please change either username and email username does not available username and email use both username and email for register now remove single label that is label 2 and reassign the label just after the port text boxes save this and run the application yeah that is please change the either username and password if one is matched with this please change their username and email so thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorial